All right, I'm going to do a video on my porch and my house for Easter. Tomorrow is Easter. <laughs> Finally cleaned up the house. This is this I got from a company. I love it. I can see the birds from the inside. Love that. Nothing much. I did get a new wreath from Timu recently. I don't think I showed it. Look at that. I think it was like $11 or something. I could paint the hello. I haven't done that yet. I cleaned and organized today, so that's why you're getting invited into my home. Here we go. There's my family wall. Picture wall. Nothing much here. Let's see here. So, I'm watching Luke Beasley. Anyway, so here is, I was going to do this a little earlier, but the neighbor was mowing, so that wouldn't have sounded too good. So here's one of my tiered trays. Taking a drink, guys. You can make sure you take a drink. I didn't turn any of my... Here, I'll show you what this does. This is from Amazon. Isn't that cute? So my little Easter tree. Margaret made me this shelf, I think, two years ago. Isn't that cute? So I decorated that. And I put a couple of little Dollar Tree with the clips and birds. And here's some of my boonies. Somebody sent me that. I think last year. Isn't that the cutest? It's even holding a little book. Gosh. And then I bought three more of these with the intention of gluing their hands together and doing the egg holding eggs. <laughs> Haven't done that either. And there's some of my other, my cat and dog. Another cat. And here, let me show you my little, I love that light. Got that off Timu. Isn't that pretty? I got this when I moved in here about five years ago now, four years, and for my mantle from Hobby Lobby. And here's this, and these are the Dollar Tree right there, little picks, and then this beautiful bouquet, and I just stuck some gnomes and things in there, and there's some more Dollar Tree gnomes. And then going across are the, these are the Dollar Tree I don't think these are Dollar Tree. I don't remember. I've had them a few years. But these garlands, and I added this tulip one this year. Dollar Tree. Man, I hope they don't go out of business because they raise their prices, just saying. So I thought I'd take you on a quick tour. There's nothing too different. I did change the bins here to go with my new carpet. I had a um, brown, a, kind of a beige one here. And I changed it to this after a spill took place. So I changed the colors of my bins to go with the carpet. Silly, probably, but I think it looks better. I didn't want to pattern these. I used to have pattern ones here. And that pattern, just couldn't do it. The feng shui just wasn't there, ladies. Okay. My sons, love that picture. And then up on my, I never did make a bow. And those are some Dollar Tree eggs and some birds in that wreath, also from Timu. Their wreaths are really a good deal. So if you're wondering, I approve. They're good. And then over here, I have my window mirror. And this tiered tray here. Cute, cute, cute. And here is some... I didn't hang the third one. I kind of got, I put all this out and then I kind of got lazy with it and didn't really do too much this year. But yeah, and here I cleaned this up. So this is where I've been doing my crafting because I can watch my TV, have my fire if I want. So I bought two of these from Michael's when they 50% off or something. I mean, I got a really good deal down in the $20 range. Under 25, I know that. There's my lamp that I love. And then these are also from Timu because I eat here and things and I have granddaughters that come over. So I like this covering and I got the two. They don't match perfectly, but they go over the armrest. This I got and I can drink my coffee if I'm careful. I have spilled it. Um, it's just that it latches there and you can put it there as an end table. This is the new coffee table that started me crafting down here. And... Well, you know how these work. Let me see. Sorry, I hope I'm not making everybody sick. Okay, here we go. 
Nope, I gotta do it from the middle. So yeah, <laughs> here's. I'll probably put that down when the kids come over. They see my house all the time, but it was a good. Ex I needed to clean up. There we go. There. See, sure, sure, ain't that pretty? I got that at a thrift store. So there I can sit and watch my birds in the window. I just really enjoy being down here. I am organizing my craft room. I've done a lot today. I did a lot, got a lot done, so I'm very proud of myself. Vacuumed a couple times, took a couple times. So there's the quilt that a friend of mine made me. And another cover on that, just, you know, grandchildren and whatnot. So at least it's not plastic. Remember the big heavy plastic? Oh my gosh. Those were like, why bother? Nobody wants to sit on that. Okay. Anywho, this is that pioneer woman-like print on this tablecloth. Isn't that pretty? Demo. There's that. I think it goes well with that. And I have Easter up there. Here's my, I got it on Facebook Marketplace, but it's from Hobby Lobby. It's my, I have two tiered trays that are big, right? Just love this. I think I got this last year at TJ Maxx. Looks like a chocolate mold. My friend Judy sent me that. That's a cute little tree. Cute. And then this little stand from Target a couple of years ago. So I just put things on that so you can elevate things on your trays. And then my shelf, bookshelf. Didn't do too much to that. Oh, but look up there. See the sticker, that wall sticker, Timu, that I showed recently? Very cute. My sister sent me that, gave my other sister and I each the sister. There's three of us. I got that at, I think it was Michael's on very low clearance. I got one for myself and one for Margaret. So, yeah. And down here are the kids' books and then this basket full of blankets and it's hiding stuff back. I'm good at hiding things. <laughs> Here's my what I'd made recently from Coca Rosa. Aren't those pretty? And I just took double stick tape, just a little piece, and put them up in the window. Look what I got the other day at for eleven dollars Walmart. It matches that picture. I mean and I got that at Walmart. I was like, I have to have it. It's crooked, so don't need to tell me. I have some. I have a really hard time with pictures being straight. And I can buy my own flowers. <laughs> I was laughing today. I went for a walk. And if I go to the lake, I can walk to the lake. And I can. There's a coffee stand across the street from the lake. And then a lady was selling had a, some flowers. So I. I said, can you make, because they were really expensive. I said, I can't really, I can't reason to spending that much. Could you make me a smaller one? Sure. So she did. Anyway, and here's, found this at a thrift store. Pioneer Woman. So yeah, there's my grandmother's bowl. I've just got some bread in there right now. I got my, my Pioneer Woman lamp, butter dish, toaster. There's Emma heads right to this, but she knows not everything's in there. I was going to also point out these. I have these in my bedroom, my craft room, and in here when I'm cooking, and I can just put stuff in there off the cutting board right into there and then into the garbage later. Love that. You guys have seen all of them. This is my new carpet in here, indoor, outdoor. There, It just kind of helps break it up, I guess. Makes it its own space. So all this is pretty much the same. Emma made me this for Christmas, and she gave me this recently, so it has to go with my, you know, for my birthday. She cute. Oh, my God. She rode for the first time today her bicycle without training wheels, so she had to stop, and her and her mama stopped and told me. She goes, Grandma's home. Go tell her. I got a bunch of different candles from Bath and Body. What is it? Bath and Body Works, yeah. I always get that in the other store mixed up. Anyway, so I chose a new one today. White Tea and Sage. I got some around Christmas time. Got this off of HSN. I haven't used it a ton. I'm not, it's kind of, it could be your slow cooker. It can be your 
it could go in the oven it can braise sear it does all kinds of stuff so still learn i use this thing all the time as a single person i hope to there's my little coffee. It needs to be rearranged a little bit. But here's my window. And there's the newest. Now, my good friend Judy, she's so talented. She made me these humming, a uh, hummingbird and a dragonfly. And then I got this off of Timu. And I didn't scrape off. You can see some bubbling. Anyway, I think it's really pretty. So I'm happy with that. Timu, coffee sign. Margaret's. I've got to find a spot. Once the cups come off of my windowsill then i'll put those oh we gotta water that plant today was water your plants day so anywho i got this off of timu for my coffee station because it looks kind of like pioneer woman so yeah full calf half calf decaf <laughs> no, i'm kind of crazy i got this when my journey started and it was just this at a, I think it was at a thrift store. And then I added this Serenity Prayer um, from Dollar Tree. And I was like, wow. I mean, it. I would read that to, <clears throat> excuse me, read that to myself a lot. And uh, yeah, got me through some of those hard times. I tried to surround myself with positive. Here's my laundry room slash bathroom. So here's that. I love that. I got at uh, when Margaret and I were crap our thrift store shopping. I put some. I keep. I'm keeping these are from Dollar Tree too. I'm keeping those on there. I like them. And this is Dollar Tree. That's gonna be up there. It's got the word blessed on it. Dollar Tree and I think Hobby Lobby. So yeah, that is pretty much the extent of my decorations. But yeah, I just thought I'd come and on and share that with you and wish you all a happy Easter. Having the kids over tomorrow. And like I said, they've seen my home. I mean, I pop in all the time, so it's not like, but it just gave me a reason. I needed to get this cleaned up. Oh, I don't think I showed this. Pioneer Woman. Dollar Tree. Jelly beans. Love it. Got this recently. I love those little bouquets on clearance at Hobby Lobby. And there's another truck that Margaret made me. Isn't she cute? Look at that bunny. And then I really didn't do anything down here. It's my mom's cookie tray. I could have put stuff on it, but I never got around to it. I'll have to pick that up when Miss Vienna comes in uh, May. Because she likes, you know, she's two. Almost two. So, you know, everything is... A curiosity. So, and I again, I've always said I don't want to be the grandma that um, has to say no, don't touch that. I just put things up. So yeah, very happy. I'm glad. It feels good to have the room cleaned up. Working on the, putting things away in my craft room, and uh, there's that sign I made. My gosh, too fun. So I love my little cozy place, and I just wanted to invite you all in for a little bit to see it and share it with you, and wish you all a happy Easter. All right, guys, take care. Talk to you soon. Bye.